your boy Rose here and I'm back with a new video. Now today we're going to be doing a, a shoe review. Now these shoes I'm going to be doing the JW Anderson Cap Chain Loafers, the original black style. I think they're the original ones. I think they were the first ones to be released if I'm not mistaken. And then now they have just the various colors and different colorways with the chain being different. So yeah, so let's get to it y'all. These are the box that they come in and I got these from Browns. And I got this size in a 42. Um, I always say go up a size. I wear a nine to ten which is nine nine and a half ten so but in italian sneakers i always try to go a size up i know there's things like you're not supposed to wear socks with them but i do because i'm just like that i'm not that tight so this is like the little duffel bag that they come in um this is a brown bag they have too which so in my last video i talked about they're my top three luxury websites you can check that video down below and it comes in, and this is what it looks like i mean i've worn these before but this is what it ultimately looks like with the paper being right here and then like the tissue paper and I'm gonna only take out one, which is this one. Here they go. These are the slides. Now this is 100% leather with 100% leather lining, and this is like a the rubber sole, and it has JW Anderson right here, and this is like the back of it. Um, they kind of feel like a, a Birkenstock, so they're not the most comfortable shoe, but these are really good for styling. This is a video of me kind of wearing this outfit while I style these. Um, I saw these in two different outfits, but I'm gonna show you the one that without this coat because I wore it with this coat before. <laughs> so, I mean, they're pretty okay in terms of comfortability. They're not like the most comfortable shoe. So I wouldn't get it for comfortability. They're more for style and, you know, look. They're very like in your face. This is like the sound that it makes if you ever wonder. So it's kind of like a very flamboyant. So, like people would definitely notice these shoes when you're walking with them. So if you want something that's like really pop out and you want something that you can slip on, and kind of like a, a Birkenstock, but more, you know, upgraded. I definitely say get these. I would say the retail price it was definitely between six fifty to seven hundred dollars, depending on from what I've seen. You could definitely get these right now. They're on sale for forty percent off, so you can get these for like three something, which is good. Um, I definitely got mines for like the low too. So yeah, I would definitely say get these for the low if you can. But if you want them right now, you know, pay what you think they're worth. It really nothing spectacular. This is the inside. It does bend. Um, I would definitely say keep these in there so you won't crease the size because like again, they're kind of easy to get creased a little bit. Like I have little small creases and I probably wore them twice. I mean, you can get away with it in a black shoe other than any other color shoe. But I would definitely say try to keep these in place to make sure they uphold right here because you don't want it to look crazy. And you know, and these are expensive too. So if you're investing your money into it, you definitely want to make sure you're keeping them nice, crisp and fresh. These, I believe these were like the 2020 collection. So these came out like three years ago. I knew about these for a long time, but I just never bought them because I was like, you know, do I want them, do I not? I envisioned an outfit for them. So I was like, I definitely have to give them. And that's the type of person I am. And these are a shoe that you can really put with anything and probably make your outfit go up. These are kind of versatile because they're really good with streetwear, but also you can pair them for a professional slash semi-formal wear. So they do have a little bit of versatility in them and depending on how you pair and how you style it. But yeah, I feel like these are a great shoe. This is the second one and they're pretty decent. I would definitely say wipe them down if you can, if you see any marks on them before you go out. That's just like personal preference or just if you want, if you just like to have nice shiny shoes. But yeah, these are the JW Anderson slides. Make sure you uh, check these out. I'll put a link below of where you can get these at. Uh, let me know if you like them, if you got them, how do you feel about them, Instagram and social media to see a picture of me wearing them. Keep liking, keep subscribing, keep sharing, and I appreciate y'all. See y'all on my next one.